Uh, well, I kind of took uh, some of the canon of each of the characters and kind of zeroed in and focused on certain aspects of it and embellished from there. Um, my take on Batgirl, like Ryan, is that for her, you know, being a superhero is just like the funnest fun thing ever. And, um, you know, she, I'm, I'm uh, using Barbara Gordon, and, you know, she grew up, her dad was working with Batman, so she was just that close to him, and she's a fan. She is a fan of Batman ever since she was a little girl. And being a superhero and taking on his mantle has just been a childhood dream of hers. So now that she's older, she's 15 years old, and she's got the chops, she's just living her dream, having fun, and just being a total geek about it. Um, Supergirl, you know, I took the idea that Kara is from, she's from Krypton. She has all the same abilities Superman has. She's essentially the same as he is. But she doesn't get any attention. It's just, it's just Superman, Superman, Superman all the time. And she's totally top liver. And if I was, you know, 16 years old, that would really make me mad. You know, it's like, you know, Superman's her cousin, but she's just totally this dynamic of like your older perfect brother gets all this attention and nobody notices you. Even though you're, you know, you're just as talented or just as special or just as great. So I'm making Supergirl a little bit of the hothead of the group, um, which I think goes really hand in hand with her power, which is super strength. Um, so she's a little bit of a, you know, a little bit of a violent maniac. Um, <laughs> <laughs> oh, great! <laughs> <laughs> a little bit. A little bit. Um, then uh, Wonder Girl, I'm taking. Um, you know, she's a princess. She's Wonder. I'm using Donna Troy. She's Wonder Woman's younger sister. She's raised on Samascara as a royalty um, and trained as a warrior. So she's very serious. She's, like, more serious than she really ought to be. She's very regal. She's very um, uh, uh, responsible. She's very um, she's very formal. And um, she's, she's the oldest. She's 17. She's a little bit of the leader of the bunch just because she knows what's going on a little bit, but because she was w- raised way, way far away from the world of man, she's a little bit of clueless about some of the things her friends say. So, like, any any slang they use or pop culture references, they, they might make just completely go over her head. So it's like it's a little bit of her Achilles heel is that she's just as smart and trained and, and uh, authoritative she is. There's just a lot of stuff she doesn't get.